How is it going, everybody? This is RBT coming at you with my Military Bowl recap video. Marshall beats Maryland 31-20. to And you know what? I get another game wrong. This has been by far my worst bowl season ever in my whole entire life. Uh, I thought I did about last year. I was about half and half last year. I'm like 2-7 and seven right now. It's ridiculous. Every team I pick finds a way to lose. and uh, it's, it's aggravating. But anyways, this game was kind of a shock. I thought Maryland was going to beat Marshall after the way Marshall played horribly defensively against Rice in this USA Championship, but they came out. Rakeem Cotto played great. I've always known Rakeem Cotto's been a great quarterback. He's an absolute beast. He was he was the only quarterback to keep up with Geno Smith stat and uh, stat wise last season, and he's an absolute beast. Uh, he does not turn the football over, and he, he can throw the football all over the field. I would not I would be very surprised if he did not make an NFL roster. He has he's accurate, has a big arm, and he he's a, he's a really good quarterback. And uh. It does not surprise me one bit that he had a great game because he's a, he's an absolute amazing quarterback and it's a good start for a lot of AQ teams out there. An absolute beast. But congratulations to Marshall. Had a great season. Ends up with 10 wins. Uh, best season in, I think, a pretty long time. They go out and beat they, uh, a, a, a member of the ACC moving into the Big Ten. So basically they beat a Big Ten team. So congratulations. A huge win for Marshall. Maryland, it, uh, you got to look back. Maryland fans, you got to look back and think this season maybe seven and six losing a bowl game was a disappointment but you gotta think last year was horrible a horrible season so I think it's a pretty good rebound and I think you should be happy how the season ended up I mean obviously not for loss but an overall perspective you should be happy but Marshall great season congratulations I mean an absolute amazing season it'll be tough coming back next year uh, repeating the way you, with uh without Raheem Cato because he's been an absolute beast but you gotta you gotta stay in the present right now because a great season so hats off to you congratulations but with this game, uh, Marshall pretty much controlled the whole entire game up until the fourth quarter. Maryland came roaring back, but it all came down to Rakeem Keto and the de defense of Marshall. Unexpectedly came up huge in the late in the fourth quarter and, and uh, pretty much won them the game. Uh, Rakeem Keto also had a huge game, too, and the defense was amazing for Marshall on third downs. They had held Maryland to 2 of 14 on, on, on third downs. It was amazing. Um, and they didn't turn the ball over, and if you don't turn the ball over, you're going to have a chance to win every game. I don't, can't, stress that, stress, can't stress that enough. Teams, no matter how bad you are, if you can control the football and win the football, uh, win the turnover margin, you're going to you're gonna be in each and every game, and that's what Marshall did. I mean, they're a good team. Don't get me wrong. I was just using that as an analogy. And they they uh, have Rakeem Kato to uh, hang their hats on, and he played lights out and played amazing. And the, the running backs played pretty well. For uh, Marshall as well, um, <clears throat> uh, they ended up. Talaferro ended up 19 carries, 81 yards, and a touchdown. Cato added uh, 15 on the ground, and uh, Watson had 42. Akeem Cato ended up 28 of 44, 337 yards, three touchdowns, no interceptions. A great game against uh, AQ defense. And uh, CJ Brown, uh, 14 to 24, 197 yards, two touchdowns, one interception. I expected him to play a little bit better than he did. Uh, you had Ross with 20 carries, 116 yards, and uh, receiving you had Hoskins for Marshall, had 104 through the air, so, and two touchdowns, a great game for Hoskins, and uh, just a great game for Marshall, great win, what a great win for this program, uh, They, sh uh, if I'm not mistaken, they're joining the AAC in the next couple seasons, I could be mistaken, hopefully not, because it's a great program with a really good fan base, all the tradition, so I think... Their program that should be looked at by AQ school. So I'm pretty sure they're joining the ACC, AAC. If I'm wrong, they should be looked at the conference because they're a really, really good team. And uh, how ironic would it be for a team like Marshall? Well, no, never mind. Got mixed up with ACC and AAC. But a uh, big win for Marshall. Like I said, congratulations. Uh, final stats team wise for the team um, Marshall had 475 yards to Maryland 397. But we all know it came down to the fourth quarter, and Mar uh, Marshall's defense came up huge late in the game. Had some great stops. Uh, 138 yards rushing for Marshall, 194 for Maryland. Um, penalties were about even. Uh, so, um, yeah, C.J. Brown actually had 38 yards on the ground as well. So, uh, that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought about this game in the comment section below. Please make sure to big hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more bowl game recaps. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, I'm coming at you with recaps of every single bowl game. Uh, Washington and BYU is on right now. I'll recap that one. I still got to recap the bowl game between Syracuse and Minnesota. So that's it.
Uh, please follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash srtr. Roll Tide, go Sox, go Titans. See you, and I'll catch you guys later. Have a great day. Peace.